Good league. This is like good league. The <laughs> 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 it's not even bronze. It's not bronze. No, no. It's wood league. It's Prince Iron wood league. league. Prince would love league. to see this. You have wood league, iron league, bronze league. Now. No, if iron league would be higher than bronze, bro. Come on, you gotta know your alchemy. <laughs> Prince would love to see this, so you should record it, Achilles. Yeah, I already hit the record. Oh, no, 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 no. You know what we're gonna do? You know what we're gonna do? Are you ready? We're gonna go a build called Praxy ha Proxy Hatchery. Are you I'm ready? ready? I'm ready. I just oh. need to tell you what to do. <laughs> 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 you are gonna play the build that the world champion played in his last match versus Stadia. Was Was he Asian? He was of Korean. Course. Of course. Yes, okay. Life. I'm gonna win That's then. <laughs> okay, the first thing you do is you send one of your drones to his base. Okay, to scout, right? Actually, no, wait, wait, wait. You, we're gonna wait, we're gonna wait. We're, you're gonna make three drones at the beginning. Okay. And when you hit nine supply... More, more! Uh, v, Z, V, S, D, V, S, D, V, S, D, keep I'm spamming. spamming. I'm spamming, I'm spamming. Okay, good. It. When you hit nine supply, on the top right, you go uh, Overlord, right? You know that. Uh, yes. Okay, so w one more drone, and then you queue up an overlord. When you queue up your overlord, you send... Oh shit, he's zerg too, I completely forgot he's zerg. Okay, we're just gonna 6-pull him. Uh, 10-pull him. Wait, wait, Shadi, let's first do the intros. What intros? Because I'm recording. Ah, uh, of course, of course. Okay, go. start, go, you do red. Spawning um. in the bottom left, it is the red zerg. Red. And what in next? the top right, we have our blue zerk. It is Jonas Knee. Okay, so this is what you do. Now you're gonna save. You're gonna save your stuff. You're gonna save until 200, and you're gonna build a pool. Okay, so now I build spawning pool. Yeah, and queue up a drone right after it. This is the nine pool. This is new meta, boys. New meta. All right. Hype. So you you queue up one more drone. All right. And now you just save minerals. Do I want to have 11 supply? Or yes, 10? 10 supply. Yeah, that was weird. I don't know. There you go. So now, right. after this, you're, you're queue up your units to his base. After your spawning pool finishes, like, hit, select your hatchery, press Y, and s select his base. Where's his base? Top right of the map. Okay. And then just, when your spawning pool finishes, you just continue to build zerglings. <laughs> Right. Never stop. Don't build drones anymore. Just build zerglings. Do You're gonna want to go across. No queens required, bro. Okay. Actually, so you I... might get get one queen. Might be good. Might be good. So I literally just spam zerglings. Yeah, that's it. That's how you win this game. And he went really to... early pool too, so it might be a little tough. You're gonna need to kill his pool so he can't build zerglings. Do I have to oh, give them gonna... or orders or anything? Yeah, yeah. Just go. GD, you have to Keep stay going. neutral, man. You have to stay neutral. Why? Why would, he, why would he want to stay neutral? Remember, you have to kill his pool so that he can't build zergli zerglings. Okay. He, he, should be, he should be starting his first two zerglings now on any standard zerg opening. Your I'm zerglings starting. are... Your, you have like eight zerglings to his two. So you kill his zerglings, and then you kill the spawning pool. There's your uh, queen. Inject. 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 Inject the hatch. There you go. <laughs> Okay. Yay! Overlord, Overlord, Overlord. Um. Kill the spawning pool, kill the spawning pool. <laughs> kill the zerglings, kill the zerglings, kill the zerglings. Kill the zerglings, I'm going zerglings to. Are killing your zerglings. Kill I'm the zerglings. Him. This is game changing. <laughs> okay, kill the pool. Not the roach war in the pool. I'm Not trying. the drones. Yes, yes, yes. Well done, my minion. <laughs> <laughs> Run away! Run, Run away! Go! Okay, attack it again! Attack it again! Kill the zerglings! There you go! You're doing well, buddy! You're Yay. doing well! Once you kill a pool, you run away it? with your zerglings! Is he gonna lose because it? Is he gonna lose it? Oh, this is so close! Oh my god, run away, 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 run away! Run away! No, no, kill it, kill it, kill it, because he's Now go kill it! Now go kill it! Now go kill it! Oh! Hi. Run away! Run away! Run away! Run away! Run away! Run away! I have nothing left. Run it's okay. Away. It's okay. He has nothing either. Right. Keep building zerglings. Now, oh I my am. God! You've won. You've won the game. He can't build units. Oh, he can build roaches. He has a roach, Warren. I know. Oh, he, doesn't, he doesn't have gas. He doesn't have gas. You're fine. You're fine. 
Kill his queen now. And then go for the drones, and then go for the roach warren. Run your zerglings away! Run your zerglings away! Should I just, yeah. like, build up... Ah, oh, I should kill his other base. Yeah, right? yeah. No, 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 don't kill his other hatch. It's 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 bait. You're, you're gonna need to kill any units he makes. Can I just kill... I right, know, right. Um... His, his, his queen. His queen is easy. His queen is easy. There you go. Good man. Okay, attack. Alright, all out. Just kill his zerglings. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, now go to home. Go to home. What does Keep that mean? Injecting. Like, oh, yeah, yeah, I already home. injected again. Yeah, I already Build another it. hatchery, but this time build it, like, near his base. Okay, so... I'll literally build it right next exactly. to the base. Exactly, exactly. And how should I That's kill his drones? That's called the manor hatch. Or? That's called the manor hatch. Kill the drones, yeah. Yeah, good man. Yay! Good man. <laughs> <laughs> Finish off the roach board so he doesn't build roach. Does he have gas? Oh, not really, but yeah. Yeah! GG! Yeah. GG! I won! <laughs> I didn't think it was possible. Score screen. That's called the 10 pool. Well, 9 pool. Alright, 9 pool. I'll have to you remember that. Attack. That you was good. Win. That was good. There's, Thank you. Sana. There's even there's even a more aggressive form of that called the six pool, which is you don't build any units at the beginning. You just wait until you have two hundred minerals, and then you just build zerglings. You don't even make workers or a queen. I had really low APM, and we have a fifty nine against a forty eight APM. <laughs> <laughs> well, I didn't. Did I? Should it have been a lot higher? Like I didn't have to do multiple things at once. Mm. You should you should ask for a rematch and this time play as Protoss. Or okay. can I play against Jonas? You wanna play Jonas? <laughs> yeah, I wanna play against Jonas. Hello there guys and girls and everything that's in between. Match number two <laughs> of Jonas Knee versus Red. Top right! It's the red Protoss. It's red. And in the bottom left we have again our blue Zerg. Representing Team IDE, it is Jonas Knee. That's okay, rhymes. so keep building workers. Don't ever stop workers. I built the oh, pylon. That, the pylon was way bad. too early. Way too okay. early. It's okay. Send the worker back to work. Okay. Yeah. Back to, get back to work. Okay, so you're gonna have a bit of an early uh, pylon here. Now, once your pylon finishes, you want to select your nexus and hit C, and then select um, the nexus again. With left, that's like, left chrono clicking. boost. Yeah, that makes things happen faster. So create a worker and then queue up another worker. Yeah, see now he's being created faster. Now okay. queue up one worker at a time, and once you get 150 minerals, build a forge. So I should be building a now, forge right now. Yes, build a forge. And that's F. Now take that probe to his side of the map. Go 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 go. And build a probe. Keep building probes. One probe at a time. Remember. Okay, one probe at a time. Have your nexus. Um, on a hotkey, like control 4 or something. So that you can access it quickly. Again, another probe. Yeah, there you go. So now you're you're gonna keep saving, one probe at a time. And then what you're gonna do is you're gonna build three pylons at the top of his ramp. And you're gonna wall it off so he can't exit. Okay. That's a nasty cheese, man. So three pylons. No, no, back. Come back. Come back. Come back at the edge mm -hmm. of his ramp. Go so right here. Not at the bottom. At the top. Keep uh, building workers. Remember. Um, yeah. There you go. That's it. No, that's no, 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 no. Cancel it. <coughs> cancel it quickly. Cancel. How do you cancel? All right. Um. Yeah. Oh, he's pulling. He's already pulling. Okay. Do it again. Do it again. But have it touch the edge. Okay. Oh, it's it's gonna break. It's gonna die. It, it, it's it's gonna die. I expected too much of you, my friend. You did, okay. definitely. Uh, build, a, build a cannon in, in your mineral line. Um, as close to your workers as possible. Because he's gonna definitely send units across the map to deal with you now. And I would build another pylon in your base. Okay. Um, 
much different. Okay, now you want to build a gateway. Um. Alright, yeah, that's easy enough. Yep. And now you want to build an assimilator. E R uh, B A. And the probes that build buildings, when you build the building, hold shift and like right click them back on the mineral line. And yeah. Just go work. I didn't. Well, is it that way for Zerg? I didn't know. No, that you Zerg, could. Zerg drones. Um, Zerg drones essentially become the building. Alright. And I'm supposed to just keep making one... Yeah, one at a time, and remember to chrono boost your nexus. Now you want to send three in gas. Three of your workers. And... Now you want to add some more... Uh, you want to add a cybernetics core, which is BY. Um, BY. Where does that go? It doesn't matter. Anywhere that's powered. Oh, okay. I see what it is. That's why I was trying to build it outside of places that weren't powered. Yeah. Now, with that same probe, add two more gateways. Alright. Um... Okay, good. Now build a pylon. Remember to keep workers. Alright, now you can send him back to work. Now the gateway that's ready, select it. Yeah. Double click on it. Mm -hmm. It'll select all your gateways, hit control 2. And then like set a waypoint somewhere near your ramp. Where is my ramp? Okay. Alright. And then make stuff? Make one zealot. Alright, um, so Z. Cool. Now, at your cybernetics core, you want to research something called warp gate research. And that's basically, you select the core and you hit G. Where's the cybernetics core? Um... Oh, you're gonna be in trouble. Holy <laughs> shit. Make zealots. Oh, Keep making zealots with your uh -huh. gates. Cool. Right, don't don't um, queue too many up. Don't queue too many up. It's useless. Cybernetics. Okay. Yeah, there you go. Now chrono boost the cybernetics core and bring your zealot back closer to your nexus. There you go. So you only chrono boost once. If you double chrono boost the same building, you'll you'll uh, it'll be useless. So he's gonna probably kill you now. I see. Select all your probes. Select all your yep. probes. And mm -hmm. right click your own cannon. Right click your cannon. L right click oh, your okay. cannon. Surround it. Yeah, there you go. There you go. Keep spamming right click on the cannon. And now send your units to kill it. Oh, yeah. Alright, cool. Now send your workers back to working. Okay. You've just held. Yay! Chrono Boost Cybernetics Research and add another pylon. Alright. Um. Now okay, you want to expand. So take one of your probes, go okay. below your ramp, and build a nexus. B N. There you what go. What are you doing? And I'm build a pylon Jonas next to it. Playing StarCraft? Yeah, I'm playing Jonas Leaf. <laughs> oh, in StarCraft. Okay. <laughs> they keep making okay, zealots. Okay. Uh, now you want to stop making zealots because your cybernetics research is almost done, and I'll show you a cool trick with Protoss. That's awesome. So build another pylon near your natural base, because we're going to build some cannons there for defense. Okay. And uh, build another uh, assimilator in your main, like a gas collecting thing, and make sure both of them have three workers working inside of them. Uh, yeah. Okay, so your, your research is complete. Now hit your two, and hit G three times. Two, one, two, three. Uh -huh. Cool. Now your gateways have transformed into warp gate researches. And what this means is you can build units by hitting W, and then okay. S, Z, or E. And so then you can hit. spawn them in a power area, and they just warp in. So I'll just hit W... So for example, go W, S, 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 and left click, left click, left click. Ah, oh, I see, that's sweet. Also that's how Protoss bit... builds units, basically. Also seems a bit unfair. <laughs> it's uh it takes lots of time to get ready and uh 
Protoss is a faction where units cost a lot, so it's it's pretty should balanced. I, should I build more units at the new base? Like you should now select order? your nexus and then shift click the next nexus and then hit control four, so they're both your control four group, and then right click the mineral patch in your in your second base. So that all the probes go work there from now on. And then you can cr you can queue two of them at the same time. Okay. Cool. Now keep building units, so W S S S S or W Z Z Z Z to keep building zealots. And the triple S will just build one zealot at a time? I mean, no, one, like um... uh, each... When you hit W, you'll see that there's like a green. There's green and then there's... Uh, like a sign of it grayed out. So yeah. It tells you how many units you can warp in and there's a timeout. There's okay. a timer. Here come the roaches. You're probably gonna die here. Yeah, you're gonna die. Warp in units, warp in units. Ooh, I think I'm dying. Yes, indeed. You're warping in one unit at a time. You can be warping in multiple. Yeah, I see how it works now. Yeah. It's okay. Keep your keep your stalkers up. No, 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 no. Don't go down to meet them. Keep your stalkers up. Run n run near your cannon. Remember your cannon? Run near. <coughs> yeah, run near your cannon. Cool. Now keep warping in stalkers. Yep, I am. Okay, your cannon's gonna die. Now double click all your probes and A move to attack the roaches. Hmm. Like hit A and yeah. yeah, there you go. Now they're attacking. Keep warping in stalkers. Never stop. Never stop. You could actually hold this. Your your probes are not doing anything. Yeah, though. I know. Oh. It's looking tough, Red. I know. <laughs> looking tough, man. You're gonna lose to the swarm. Oh no! GG, Red. GG. I never quit. I never quit. You're dead, Red. I know. <laughs> <laughs> You're dead. <laughs> oh, no GG. GG. Oh I didn't my say it last man. time God, either. What a game. A nail-biting game. <laughs> Not really. 34 whole APM. <laughs> 14 APM. No, 23. Uh, but you never play the game, so. Uh, no. Oh, um, finals. Yes, yes. Finals. DVT. Both. No, I've never fought. I, I, Zerg, I feel confident I can win with. I have more experience with them. Protoss is hard, you see. Well, it, I, I think it is hard, but also I had no idea what I was. You like. had no idea how it was. So, worked. we will totally. see you in game three. We are back on Overgrowth for the finals of DreamHack 2014. <laughs> <laughs> we have in the top right, we have our red Zerg. It is red. And at the bottom left, <laughs> our blue or teal zerg, as it so happens, it is Jonas D. <laughs> oh man, you have to see my camera work when you intro. It's amazing. All right. So unlike last game, we're not going to be coaching red meticulously this game. Both players going for a rather standard opening. To uh, be uh, to be quite honest. I basically coached during the knee in the last <laughs> game. You did. Oh, did you? Wow, you did. <laughs> wow. I was like, yeah, dude, you should go in now with all your roaches. And I was like, target the pylons. <laughs> no, so Red is already floating uh, a shit ton um, of minerals here. Um, it's like he's uncertain what he wants to do. Maybe I hatch first. Exactly. Pool, right? And now I Jonas knee, remember. this game being more proactive with his overlords. Nine pool. Ten pool by, uh, by, uh, by our friend Red here. Jonas need though. Working the drone machine. Looks like he's going for a hatch first. Maybe not. He's going for a spawning pool. This is a 14 pool. Now the next the hatch would probably come in from Jonas Need when he gets enough money. It should be pulling no gas. away. 
No gas from either players, which is kind of uh, strange. Yeah, I'm going for strange. it, guys. I'm going for it. This means for a very economical opening. Oh, wait. Wait. 16 gas. <laughs> New meta. <laughs> <laughs> And you can see that uh, Jonas Knee has formed a pair of nipples on the map of his overlords. <laughs> <laughs> he actually has. <laughs> he has not uh, moved them, and uh, the same can be said for uh, Red, who has just parked his overlords in the back, and does not wish to scout with them. Oh, fine. Both players uh, are going for a gas, but uh, Red here now starting only to add drones to his gas, which is uh, sitting idle there for a good 30 seconds. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Thanks. Now. Still no expansion from either player at 3 minutes and 35 seconds. <laughs> <laughs> I love how you're, you're just Here making it comes. fun of this, though. Red. By Red. Red gets the hatch first award. Jonas, the floating 600 minerals at 4 minutes. There we go. There also goes the hatchery for Jonas Knee only a couple of seconds later. Indeed, isn't, indeed. Isn't a big deal. Not yet, but... It can be a big deal if you inject properly. None of these players injecting with their queens. In fact, Red doesn't even have a queen. I'm getting one. Getting his queen at 4.30. <laughs> at 21 supply. <laughs> you know Meanwhile, what? Meanwhile, Jonas Knee has also the let's not put workers in our gas disease. And he has left his for a good <laughs> two minutes now. But Does he injected. have any sort of military forces, or should I just go balls to the walls? We can't tell you that. You should tell me that, though. Finally, Red's Overlord is making his way across the map. Scout. <laughs> and the first player is gonna scout after five minutes in. <laughs> I was scouting. <laughs> Never know what your opponent of. is up to. Gotta check. It probably. Well, Look at this, a second gas from Red. I wonder what he's gonna do with all that gas. <laughs> <laughs> it's gonna be a Meanwhile, cheese. Meanwhile, Jonas Lee now moves his bros into the gas, and he's starting to acquire 12 gas at 5 minutes 45 seconds. New meta, boys. <laughs> Here we go, the, the zerglings of Jonas Knee lurking about. will probably be spotted by Red's overlord here as he makes his way into the base. Both players... Floating a solid 600 plus minerals. Jonas Knee, will he hit Facebook money? No! no. Barely hit. Barely. None of these players going for Zergling speed. None of these players going for any additional tech structure. I, I will be. I will be. Here goes the met. Oh my god, they get metabolic boost at the same time. It's like and we're reading your mind, bro. Here we go, Jonas Knee moving across the map. Also behind this, getting a roach worm. See how Red deals with this. He still has one queen, even though he has two hatcheries. I'm getting the other one. It's just taking time. Here come the zerglings from Jonas. A huge amount of zerglings. He has two to one. Oh, the micro! Will Red oh. just fight? The micro is real. Red pulling back, even making a spire. This is a ah. real 100, 160 the micro queen? from Jonas. Oh, there are too many zerglings. It I'll appears that our friend Red is unaware of how to build units. I am building them. They're just really <laughs> slow for some reason. And he's Why attacking. Why am I attacking my own base? <laughs> new meta, boys. What is going on? As Jonas Lee, for some reason, pulls back, even though he can kill all of this with his units. Here he goes, going in surround and get the queen. Red loses the queen for nothing. Now trying to push this back, he probably has enough units to do so, and he will. Again, Jonas Knee behind that attack, floating a gorgeous 1,500 <laughs> minerals. <laughs> but once the Spire finishes up here, Achilles, uh, our friend Jonas is going to be in huge amounts of trouble. He is teching up to Roaches, and uh, if you're new to this game, Roaches lose the air units because they can't shoot up, they can't spit that high. Exactly. They can't spit that. Now out. Jonas Knee going for a scout with four overlords. <laughs> <laughs> oh, could this be a drop? Could this be a fame drop? But there's no research for, uh, for anything. Oh my God! Look at this. There's one. There's plus one missile attack. The Zerg flyer attack from yeah, Red. It's, it's coming. He's actually spreading his creep. 
These Zerglings run by, spot the Spire, they see it come in, they see the Banelings Nest. They're actually gonna do some nice economical damage here. But uh, I don't know if Jonas Nee realizes that if uh, if Red just moves across the map now, he wins the game. Yeah, exactly. I'm not yeah. sure if that's a trap, but I'm going for it. <laughs> here go the Zerglings! Balls. Two Zerglings staying at home, keeping no, they're, watch. They're, they're coming, they're coming along Protecting for the ride. Protecting the lair. They're coming along for the ride. Jonas Nee still floating, now 2,000 minerals. He is not quite sure what to do with his minerals. Supply block as well. Ah, oh, of course. I haven't even been keeping... Here come the Zerglings, they're just gonna run by the roaches! Oh, they're just gonna run by, this is huge! And they're gonna get the queen, most likely. No, what are they attacking? They're attacking I have no the... idea what they're attacking. They're attacking the roaches that are popping up. Most of these Zerglings getting melted by the roaches, and now they're attacking the... Ah, what a waste a of mineral fail. resources! You didn't kill a single drone in that attack! <laughs> All those Zerglings <laughs> killed one queen and a couple of roaches, and now the roaches can just move across the map and win this game, Achilles! They no, indeed can. can, they indeed can, and now they're going no, for they it. Can. Where are they're the Mutalists from Red? They're coming, they're just really slow. There's oh, only one here we Mutalisk go, one Mutalisk. One Mutalisk will save the day, Achilles. All these roaches, they might be able to melt Zerglings, but they can't do anything to units that have wings! Look at this, he's getting cancer ev cancel? Cancer, what? He's getting flyer carapace. Who gets flyer carapace? Especially Did against roaches, it doesn't even matter. Will he start warping into banelings though? I don't think he has enough gas. He probably needs to take both gas geysers to go baneling. Uh, uh, Muta. There we go, this roaches is going die. in. Roach is going and going for the oh, second base. Oh, look at how base. many Banelings. I don't know if Red is aware that Banelings suck ass against Roaches that are considered I am not armor aware. units. I am not aware. And three Mutas are going to save the day here. There's nothing that these Roaches can do but walk there to their dish. The Banelings try to go for contact, but they're not on a move. They kill one Roach. Whoa, roach that's Red. Oh. <laughs> the Mutalists are real from Red. Jonas go Nee mutas! cannot do anything about these Mutas. That are just gonna go ham, but these roaches can literally kill every single worker in this game. No, they can't! <laughs> the oh, great this migration. Is <laughs> this is real. <laughs> if Jonas Nee is an intelligent human being, he goes for the spire right now to prevent the creation of mutilists, but no, he's going after these drones. <laughs> trying to get the most out of it. So many drones have been killed this day. But they live! They live going on! Going to units lost. Go to the units lost. 77 <laughs> units lost. <laughs> We shall prevail. That is, uh, that is crazy. <laughs> and if we take a look at the APM tab, we see that Jonas Nee is rocking as steady. 60 wow, FPS. They, they're averaging 73 and 71 APM each. These players are next level. Exactly, think... and now Jonas Nee is also floating a healthy 4.5k minerals. Oh, he's about to hit, he's about to hit Facebook money, Achilles. You know what Facebook money is? Facebook money is okay. 5,000 minerals. How can That's he have Facebook that many minerals? Money. Is he gonna reach it? He's Actually, close! Why aren't you reaching like Facebook money? <laughs> <laughs> I would like to point out to the kind viewers that not a single creep tumor has been spread this game. Yes, I did. I did spread From it. From <laughs> oh, okay. Meanwhile, the red does not choose red, to rebuild the hatchery. Coming, going right is for the one main base. Going right for the he main is going to one base. All in with mutas, and now this spore crawler gonna do so much damage against these mutalists that are forced to try to chase zerglings across the map. One hatch. Red is not rebuilding it because he does not have enough probes, <laughs> the drones, and he's building a queen again and three drones at a time. And with Jonas his mutal muta ball, forty-one drones at a time. <laughs> Jonas knee is not. He is. I don't think he is aware of injecting. Oh, yeah, he is. He is. He injects at about the same time. I must say, Achilles Jonas knee is is in the lead. Yes, he is He's definitely in the, in the lead. He has six K minerals. <laughs> six K minerals. The muta ball from Red doing absolutely nothing here. They're just floating. They should be harassing. These are harassing units. They were gonna They're harass. Not gonna care. They're gonna Why are they by. attacking? They're just Move. gonna run by and kill all the units here. Do your and, job. Uh, this is when uh, Red GG's. I'm not GG'ing. I'm going to win this game. 
Yes, if you harass with your mute as per. Yes, we're going to harass now. We're going to harass much. And here we go, the famed 17, munish, uh, 17 minutes, uh, 10 mute push is coming. Yes, <laughs> we are We are 17 minutes in, and the supplies are 55 and 42. Wow, next Shut up. I'm doing again, my I, best, bro. Again, Red has not rebuilt his second hatch yet. He is going to run out of minerals on his main mineral patch if he does not get a base. And now these mutas are free to come here. They should be targeting the only unit that could hit the air, the queen, and they are doing that. No, they're targeting the hatch because they're retarded. Nah, now they kill the we queen. We took care of that. And here goes a, a spore claw crawler being built. Will Red let it finish? Where is it? Ah, there it is. He targets it down. Now he can kill this base easily. Jonas Need trying to do the smart thing and counterattacking with his Zergling because he knows that the base is probably undefended. Mutas have to run back and defend for now. Looks like this second hatch from Red will be forced to either cancel or die. Exactly. Now, we will defend it. And again, the Zerglings are just going to ignore everything about life and go kill the drones because they know they've done so much economic damage. If these drones just A move against the Zerglings, they'll probably kill them, but no, they're attacking their own hatchery again. No, Here we go. Stop will they kill it. the lair? There's so Will they kill the lair? Oh my god, this is mutiny <laughs> from the every single unit from Red is attacking their own <laughs> What lair. are they doing? They are clearly angry at the Queen of Blades. And they were idle for about five seconds. So But Jonas D rocking rocking seven thousand minerals. <laughs> this is so oh, look sad. At this. We have one Hydra on the map. What does that do? That's a unit that can shoot at the sky. Ah. Can my Mutalisk can, can attack it? He is five basing right now against the Red's two base. I don't need bases. I'm a absolutely boss. absolutely doing nothing. I'm a boss. And oh my god, look at all these Banelings. Is that a good thing or a bad thing? Rolling on through. And if we look at the uh, units tab here, you can see that uh, Jonas Nee's 42 drones are in fact a little bit higher than Red's 20. Exactly. <laughs> Just a little bit, maybe double. Not a Red, big deal. Red don't care. So, Fim, Fim, are you here? Yes, I'm here. Do you still want to, uh, want to play Fox? Did I just yeah. keep, like, attacking or. Silo, Silo, we are recording. We're recording. Okay. Do you want to go to another server? You should either attack or, or you should build bases. <laughs> okay. Make a decision. We're building bases and we're attacking. I don't have enough minerals. Your mutas should be always attacking targets. They shouldn't just be standing there. Okay. They're a very versatile best. unit that can go do so much damage. They can kill drones for free. And there's one bailing rolling with them. The boss. Yes, this is this is the bailing that's gonna be a warning shot to the enemy. He's just gonna go blow up the other. Actually, if that bailing connects properly, it could kill a few drones. Here we go. Let's see what this bailing decides to do. Jonas Nee, knowing that there were mutalisks on the map, but not building any spore crawlers to counter it. He has hydras that are moving across the map now. These nine hydras will kill these mutas. But uh, these Hydras will be surprised to see that there is a big pack of Zergling waiting. A big pack of Banelings waiting ho at home. And if those Banelings get good connection with the Hydras, those light armored units are going to be in a lot of pain. Here come the Hydras. There they go. Zerglings are going to start to... Uh... Here, Here come the Banelings coming in! Come 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 oh! Every single Hydra gets destroyed! Where was the other Hydra? I thought there was one left. Oh. And now the Muta is just chilling here on the third base. And Red building... building about... 18... 18 <laughs> Banelings. I love my Banelings! I, what can I say? <laughs> oh my god, this is so funny! <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, Jonas Nee is floating 10k! He has twice the Facebook money. <laughs> oh. We should avoid that thing. He's just still building workers! Jonas D has 38 workers. Only? What? Now? Did he kill his own workers? And now Red, finally getting a chance to establish a third hatch 23 minutes into the game. 
I'm doing great, guys. And he's Don't starting to transfer probes. We are and he's attacking minutes. his own hatchery. Yes. I'm doing that again. Will he kill it? Why are they doing that? Will he kill it? <laughs> <No>. <laughs> what is wrong with me? We are 20... No, we are 24 minutes in the As game. Supplies are at 77 and 66. As I'm coming back. Achilles. As I'm coming you can back. see, Achilles, these Zerg units have a serious genetic disorder where they attack their own brethren. Yes. I'm attacking myself? Is this happening again? It'll be funny if these Banelings A move on each other and everything dies. <laughs> Don't give me ideas, guys. How do you combine shift groups? There we go. Alright, let's go do some exploration. A formidable army here from Red. Hopefully he doesn't just run all his mailings into one building at a time. Oh, do you see this, Achilles? I see do this. Do you see this from Jonas Sneed? Do you see this amazing creation? What's what's yes. the amazing creation? I'm mean, now was like really scared. <laughs> Is he rebuilding a base? Right next to one of my old banglings. Oh god, oh. please don't do it. I'm not going to, don't worry. Okay, what are my mutalisks doing? What are they what are doing? doing? What are they doing? Don't well, stop do A-moving your units. Oh, it's oh Mutal my god! Mutal. There's so many mutas coming here no! from the Jonas Knee, they're gonna kill the mutas! Oh, no! they're gonna get so smart! Like so, so smart! So smart! You should turn it around! the roaches! Run away! And again, I can't manage red, this. Red keeps A moving into his own units, killing his own guys, and he's just gonna run back like a little bitch. Yeah, because I can't manage that, bro. Oh, look at all these mutas by Jonas. He's gonna mute a counter muta 26 minutes into the game. Both players are still on solid. Zero, zero upgrades. No units have speed except Zerglings. And our good player Red here is still on 24 workers. Should I be on more? I don't know, is that a bad thing? At this point in the game, you should be at about 80 workers. Really? I'm doing ham, yes. then. Jonas Nido, floating so much money, 12,000. It's really nice to see that both players do not know what an evolution chamber is. Exactly. And, uh, look at this. So, JD, right explain, what is, an ev uh, what is an evolution uh, chamber? Yes, explain. Evolution chamber allows you to get upgrades for your units. And since you have a layer, that means you can get plus two, up to plus Hello. two. And once you get your, uh, once you get your, uh... Where's the evolution uh, chamber? You can build. Plus three upgrades, and then unit-specific ones. Where's the evolution? Oh, you can oh, get better go. things for mutas, and you can make your banelings faster. He builds one evolution chamber at 27 minutes. I took my good advice from you guys. And Jonas need building corruptors right here. Oh my god, because Corruptors are so strong against whatever he's making. This Nidus network is just sitting here, turning away. So both players are maxing out their armies. I and have no half idea an what hour I'm doing. in game, Jonas Snee going across the map with four roaches. He's gonna do some scouting, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> zero, zero roaches with no speed are gonna do the damage. You guys are too maybe, funny. Maybe these guys are a retard magnet, and maybe, <laughs> just maybe, we're gonna see some serious amounts of banelings committed to this attack. And maybe they will start roaches. attacking each other, and Red just lost, uh... <laughs> the queen. I did? Lost the queen to four roaches. I didn't even know that was happening. No, the banelings, get out of here, you guys. Hit. You see, the, the banelings scare me, because they just, like, they're just ready to go on a moment's notice. And this queen just uh, chilling across the map. Again, not a single creep tumor spread by Jonas Knee. Looks like he likes the creep tumorless style. I hear it's very uh, modern. It's very bad. Eruptors in the mix, roaches, mutas, he's got everything here, Achilles, 62 workers, he's ready for a big push, 160 supply with 0-0 zero, zero on all his units. Exactly. And he's about to get mined out from his natural. Do I have idle workers? Yes, I, I do. I idle workers. I do. What's that little button I click to see if I have idle workers? F1. 
F1. Oh, there's one across the other end of the map. I guess he's trying to make a new base. Fourth hatch coming down at 30 minutes from Red yeah, Warrior. Exactly. And uh, even though he got the evolution chamber, he's not actually researching anything because he doesn't have enough gas for it. Mind gas, you queers. This uh, Ling, uh, Ling, Bane Ling Muta combination from Red. And look at this ballsy move from Jonas Nee getting his gold sixth base. 31 minutes in the game, floating 13,000 minerals. Obviously, you need that added income from the gold to even get more money in the bank. Do you think that anyone's exactly. close to winning right now? You know what they say, Achilles. The more money you have in the bank, the less interest rates you pay. <laughs> 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 exactly, GD. Exactly. Like, seriously, do you guys think that anyone's close to winning? You guys uh, are just building shit and no one's attacking. Like, this is gonna <laughs> drag on for 30 more minutes. No, 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 no. I'm for attacking very soon. I hope I have enough space on my computer. <laughs> this has evolved into a huge game. Look at this, Jonas Nina moving to secure his gold base. I'm, Red. I'm, I'm moving to attack very soon. Oh, Red is gonna attack all these mutas with banelings, and it's gonna be a massacre for one of these sides. I can, I can promise you that much. Yes. But I'm gonna blow up all his buildings and stuff. One thing to one thing to say about Jonas is that he is still on Lair Tech, as is our good buddy. I can't Here even upgrade it, bro. Here comes the Muta Ball. It's at zero zero, and it's gonna do serious damage. It's gonna do serious damage. It is gonna go in. Here they come. Smart positioning from Jonas Knee. Here it is, killing the queen. Oh, he's going for the lair. He's going for the lair. Now Red is gonna come in. Is no, no. Is Red gonna go do damage? This is gonna be. Wow. This Jonas Knee's mutas are gonna die. No way. No, I don't. Really why are they? I didn't even click anything. He wants anything. to kill his old building. These mutas are genetically retarded. <laughs> they, I think that this game is just hating on me. I can't. I can't win. All right. You know what? Screw it. We're just. We're just doing the. We're just gonna. Oh my Jonas God! Jonas, we're waiting to mutify. This is huge, but then. Hail red. Mary coming across the map now. The Zerglings scouting ahead of the way. They're gonna slam into these roaches. Roaches now surrounded by Zerglings on all sides. But look what's coming behind. So many banelings. Oh, oh, now these roaches, come. all these roaches. All these roaches. Oh boom, my! Boom! 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 That was that was such, such a waste. A waste. <laughs> I know. It just looked pretty. <laughs> and he just slammed. <laughs> What's happening? Oh, okay, do you attacking. think Jonas Nee is going to take this home? I don't know, man. It's been such a back and forth game from these two players. It's going to be close, but Jonas Nee is closing in on the victory. He is now killing all the economy of bread. No, I'm going to run towards the sp spore crawlers and he's going to follow me. He's going to follow me. Minerals. Oh, look at no. this brave oh. queen chugging along across the map with 100 energy, and it's going to die. He's going to follow me to the spore crawlers, and then he's going to kill his own units watch I guarantee it make sure your own overlords don't kill each other no 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 they can't <laughs> they don't they don't have any attack remember <laughs> these mutas are too smart for red oh he's unlike this mutas unlike going for oh this my level God, of going for his third base all right we'll just he'll, we'll just have to ah I lost didn't I guys Actually, while he's killing that base, we'll work this one. <laughs> Solid tactics there by Red. <laughs> I should have something that I can attack him with at this point. Yeah, I do and, actually. And um, over here, Achilles Jonas Knee is close to hitting Facebook money times four. The new feat, with a new name. Where's my? Mutilus. Here it comes, Achilles. It's I coming. gave them an attack order. Ah, psh. It's coming, Achilles. Here it is. Yes. Is he gonna hit it? He only needs 800. Here it yes, is. He Facebook doesn't see me attacking four. his units. Can Red GG before I deny him Facebook times four brag rights? I'm Can not he GG I'm before? Not GGing. Can he GG before? Can he GG before? Oh, no. Is it? Is it gonna be? 
and he <gasps> is going to hit it! Guys, Facebook. I'm still going to win And if you this. look at the APM tab, you see Red rocking a solid 200 APM. Wow. Really? That's, yes. And now Jonas Knee up to 100 APM. Stop attacking me, Jonas Knee. It's not the objective. <laughs> Jonas Does he still have an army? Jonas is about to kill the spire. <gasps> no, he's killing the spire. Make a new one. 160 new against one. 38. Make a new one. Is Jonas Nee definitely winning at this point, or is it just we both suck? I think it's a mix of both. Like, to be honest, I don't even know how I've lasted this long. I'm sure you guys uh, are asking yourself the same question, but... Jonas Knee leaves the Spire to bleed out, and look, you actually get the bleed out yes. animation of the Spire, which is always nice to see. Ooh, now Red, still there. Now Red coming in with three Mutalisks. Yeah. And he is gonna die. That's what's up, bro. Jonas Knee moving across now, the like map. Like moving the across the map with all those Zerglings. I won't give oh, you that pleasure. Oh, this is GG! <laughs> No, not a GG. Uh, confusion. Um, it was bad. Something. I, I admit, Achilles, won. I throw upon you the challenge of the century. Tell me, my friend. You should play both of these guys against each other at the same time. 2v1. Oh my god. <coughs> you know what? I have better APM. That's all that matters. Average unspent resources? Dear god. He had 9,000. <laughs> Jonas, I hear, I hear. The more, it's like a Swiss the banker. The more money you get, the less interest you pay. 